Right, so we just sort of landed, gone through immigration, and uh, now we're trying to sort out our luggage. Uh, it's in here, it's a 10. So, again, no, we're not getting the MBA in Thailand, we're getting the MBA. Well, not really near here. There's, all, there's still like a seven hour bus ride, and then the next day, I think an hour and a half train. So, going through that after. So, yeah, so it's hard. 13 plus hours of flight. It's just pretty really tiring, man. So, I'll check back out and see how they sort my luggage out and my bus, maybe. We'll see. Peace. Well, okay, so I kind of just missed the bus. I'm supposed to leave at 8 a.m., and I just missed it by like literally just five, less than five minutes, maybe. So now I have to wait an hour and a half at least for the next bus to arrive and then get off one station with around 45 minutes board another bus to get to where I'm going. It sucks, it really it does I don't know the audio picking up. But yeah, it really does. It does suck a lot, which it happens. I don't usually miss times, but this first time for everything, that's what they say, but it costs me things freezing though. Like, no, for me, for me. I don't kind of know where I am right now. You don't even understand. And I'm indoors, I'm actually indoors. I'm at the bus, bus station, so. That's just that's just pretty sad. Anyway, uh, check back y'all. Uh, check back to y'all later when everything is sorted out and ready. Hopefully, a couple hours. So tired. So sad, man. Okay, what's up guys, it's, I'm here at the hotel, it's like 4 a.m. here local time, and I am tired, man, I am so beat. Let's just do a little recap if, uh, I don't know if my math, my math is correct, my mind is not functioning properly right now, but we had like a three hour flight from Manila to Thailand, if you, if you guys uh, didn't catch that, I was in Thailand. Uh... Yeah, three hours uh, plane ride to Thailand, and then I was there for like eight hours at the airport, just waiting, walking around, just ate, ate some food. It was just really nice, though. Eight hours, and then a plane ride, like more than 13 hour, 13 hour plane ride after that. And then when I got to the airport, I had to take a bus. I was supposed to take a bus at 8 a.m. then I missed it so I had to wait like an hour and a half for the second bus to arrive it had to take a three hour bus ride to a station wait I don't know like 20 minutes 30 minutes to board another bus to like three hours again to get here and then I had to walk well the walk was not really far it's like it's freezing outside man like a couple of seconds after i went outside on the streets i was like shaking my my jaw was like you know so it was brutal so i got back uh well i i got into the hotel i don't know around what time four ish p.m maybe yeah before four something like that so and then i just crashed i just slept like i Put down my stuff, uh, ate some chips, I guess, drank some warm water, and it just crashed. And it's like, well, I woke up, like, I woke up early. I woke up, I think, past 1 a.m. local time. Um, and I think it's the body clock, because 1 a.m. is like 9 a.m. 
in the Philippines. So I, I think it's it's kind of like that. So, but anyway, to, well, not tomorrow. A couple of hours from now, I'll be riding another train. Uh, I think it's about an hour and an hour, an hour and a half train ride, going to my uh, final. Not I wouldn't say final destination, but like uh, where I'm supposed to be at. So, um, yeah, and then rush, have my things, just, you know, I just leave it at the hotel. I don't, because I have a 10 a.m. Uh, induction for the school. So train leaves at around 7.40 and arrives there at like a little over past nine. And then just get my stuff in there and just try to leave as fast as I can. I don't know how, how exactly I would go from the hotel to the school. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. I mean, walk is 17 minutes, but damn, the walk is so... It's it's not it's not fun. The cold is just hits you in the face. And just, I'm not built for this. We're not built for this, you know that. But, yeah, man, we'll see. Yeah, man, I think I'll just uh, get through some emails and... Just wait until 7. Breakfast is at 7. That's another thing. I have to rush breakfast. I don't like rushing breakfast. If y'all know me, I eat, I eat a lot. I eat. Breakfast is a big thing for me, especially when I'm traveling. But, yeah, we gonna do, you know, sacrifices. Well, yeah, man. Uh, I'll see you in a bit. I'll try to get, I, I don't know, maybe I'll try to get some rest again. I don't know. We'll see, man. I'm just so, like, my eyes are, like... Ah, oh, man. All right. Peace out. We'll, we'll see you again. Check that out in a few. Whatever. Yeah. So, we are back. I'm about to check out from this hotel and head on out to the train station. We'll grab quick breakfast first, I guess. Go over to the train station, hop on a train at 7.40, I reckon. And then, just, you know, just move on from there and just drop my things at the hotel and all that. So, uh... If y'all still didn't know, I am in the UK. Which part of the UK? Right now, I'm in Manchester. So, so yeah. And then we have trains to catch an hour, an hour and a half, I guess, to go. And then we're in our final city. And that's where all the magic will happen. That's where I will be getting my MBA. Y'all soon find out where exactly it is. Again, I'm still rocking the release uh, sweats hoodie because it's really warm. It's thick the fabric is really thick and this is embroidered it's not printed or anything so you know the quality is the best so anyway check back to y'all soon hopefully when i'm at the station already peace so here we are at the piccadilly station in manchester waiting for a train to go to our destination um we are surprising the early that right now so i told you i hate being late i ain't gonna be you know the person on the last well I got I, I missed the, the bus yesterday, but hopefully it's a one-off. I don't want to miss no public transport again here because it's freezing. It's still freezing We're in, indoors, but it's still freezing. They say it's not that chilly right today, but there is a chance of snow, so we will see. Um, one thing I can say is that it's very efficient. Uh, you book your tickets online, and you get it from some of the machines. They print out the tickets for you. So, yeah, it's pretty efficient. Uh, it's pretty busy. It's quite daunting. Again, if you're first time in here, if you're alone, it's gonna be very difficult. But I'm getting through it. I'm still like sort of feeling under the weather today. Hopefully, I get better in a couple hours because there was there's a induction session at school at 10 a.m. So uh, anyway. Hopefully the train will arrive in time soon. Should be arriving in about yeah, seven, ten minutes. We'll see. Stick back with y'all. A little later. All right, peace. It's cold, freezing cold right now. <clears throat> still, you can tell with my voice, I'm still not feeling 100%, but we just concluded the induction session of the school, which was, uh, interesting I would say um, walking back to the hotel right now is freezing it's also started to rain a bit a while ago so it just doubled up my 
hatred for rain, apparently. <laughs> so, but anyway, y'all don't know yet, we are here at Chester, UK, and uh, studying at the University of Chester, getting my MBA. And that's the big reveal. Uh, this is my new reality for at least the next year. I say at least because there's, there's a lot of things that can happen between now and you know I graduate a year from now. So, but yeah, um, I guess I'll I'll put on the I'll talk about the decision process. I'm probably probably on uh, on separate videos. I I can imagine that this video has been going on for so long right now. So, but anyway, um, I'll be going back to the hotel, checking some emails, um, trying to get maybe a schedule of the of the house that I can that we can rent the next year, at least for six months, and then take it from there. Tomorrow, I said I have to go back to the school pay for the balance of the tuition fee so yeah tomorrow morning more walking all right oh, in the cold in the rain so yeah that's it i guess i'll wrap it up for this video right now check back for the other video hopefully i get to post uh more in a couple of days and uh yeah man it's a beautiful city i haven't really yet to explore it I will in a couple of days. I should actually if I'm looking for a property to rent out. But anyway, yeah, man, let's go. Peace out. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not yet. Uh, if you don't want to, that's it's okay, no problem. Um, leave a like. Hit the like button if you like it. If you don't like it, just don't click anything. Okay. Okay. So yeah, that's about it. Just. Uh, Peace, man.